And to be honest with you, growing up, I wasn't really sure I'd be able to live this long. Um, growing up, they didn't even know what prolonged QT or any of the other syndromes were. So the problem was, how do you treat something that you don't know what the problem is? Well, the fact is, you couldn't. But that was 40 years ago. And since then, organizations like the SADS Foundation have brought us from darkness to light, offering us information and treatments along the way. So that's why I'm asking you and pleading for you to join us on June the 11th for our free online meeting. What you're gonna hear are a lot of our stories and we're gonna hear yours as well. But the thing is, you're also going to be able to find out the latest developments and treatments that are available and also give you an opportunity to talk directly to researchers about the treatments that you would like to uh, see in the future. Uh, we're gonna take all this information and we're gonna put it together for our upcoming meeting with the FDA and some very important decision makers. So uh, the thing is, it all starts with you. We need to hear your story, okay? Your ups, your downs, and your thoughts for the future because it is very important that we take all these information, all these stories, and put them in front of some very important people. So please join us on uh, June the 11th. And the thing is, we need your involvement because brighter days are ahead, but it's critical that we have your involvement for success. Plus, 